And welcome back to System Shock 2. Here we are, in the heart of the body of the many. <sighs> Fighting for survival. We found a little place for a little respite here. We're recharged. We're reasonably well armed. We're pretty much raring to go. Perfect condition. Perfect condition weapons. Wormheart implant for a bit of health regeneration. Whenever we... Times are real tough, I guess. We're going to use up some of this ammo on this precious... Because... Oh, 43 fragmentation grenades. That can get me a long <coughs> way. Oh! Well. That's just not very cool, is it? Now that we've taken out the... I think we might be missing... There were three optic nerves, I believe, and I think we've taken out two. We found the mouth and teeth. And a cyborg midwife for the bargain.
anything, you know, like jumping puzzles in video games. No one wants that. No one wants that at all. This is the one that gets me munched on. you at the ceiling and just kill you. We feel you moving inside of us. The sensation, the sensation is repulsive. Peace and quiet for a moment. No gnashing of maddening, monstrous teeth. Besides the parasitic behavior evidenced in the life cycle of the human endlet hybrids, it's becoming clear to me that you can spread the many to use humans for other purposes. First of all, the many clearly have the capability to convert human flesh to energy and eat us, but it can also directly use us in the creation of a Corpses are fed into some kind of tubular structure, and eggs are birthed through a nearby tube. I've been unable to determine whether the organism is directly converting the corpses into egg structures or not, but it's clear that there's some connection between the nutrient pool we provide and the eggs that are being produced. Mm. Shodan designed them to find us delicious. We'll go this side passage. He's practically invisible here in the dark. This maddening mess. Nuke it all! <sighs> Another flesh flora, bra. You know, just in case. Pretty bad idea to be using frag grenades in the dark, so let's not do that. I can't see a goddamn thing at all. I don't know if you observe, but we are not effing around. I literally can't see the way out. So dark.
keep coming. Your time is running out. This place is a room where we grow our, our future. future. Your weapons fail. Your innovation runs low. And you've yet to see our most beautiful creation. All you have is your hatred and your individuality. Now don't you wish you joined us? Would you then feel so alone? Make compelling argument. I blew these things up. I just heard. Let's see what Sheridan's got to say about this. While I don't understand the Enlid life cycle fully, it's clearly extremely diverse. The eggs produce either a male or a female spore. The male, the drones, are wasp like creatures. The female are worm like Enlids that seek out a host to infect. Following the infection, the host begins to transform into a human Enlid hybrid. Forms take numerous paths. I believe this path is determined by the mini itself. The creatures have communicated their need to grow the biomass, so I imagine that biological material is their primary resource. Therefore, each path has costs and benefits. The proto arachnid is extremely quick and potentially relatively cheap in biomass. The hulking, fleshy ones are powerful, but are clearly a larger investment. I've observed only one example of the floating organisms. The only comfort is that the more dangerous organisms are quite costly to produce, limiting their numbers. That was not so tough. It's clear that this thing I'm trapped inside is intimately linked with all the organisms I observed on board the Von Braun. Strike that. This creature is the same organism. Perhaps the best way to describe it, or perhaps the only way I can comprehend it, is that the organism serves to perform the highest mental functions of the entire species. The smaller creatures exist only to enact its will. Now, strike that too. All the specimens act as a whole, like different organs in a single body, with this entity acting primarily as a brain. If one were to destroy this large specimen, I wonder, would it snuff out all the others? So this is one way to find out. With only a few short years of evolution, they've been able to conquer this starship, mankind's mightiest creation. Where were we after 40 years of evolution? What swamp were we swimming around in, single-celled and mindless? What if Shodan's creations are superior to us? What will they become in a million years, in 10 million years? What's clear is that Shodan shouldn't be allowed to play God. She's far too good at it. Unfair comparison, I think he's making there. I thought I saw a third. These creatures were designed, they did not evolve. They were designed for one purpose to find human beings delicious. Task they are doing exceptionally well at. So, how might I get out of this bloody hole? Not like that, obviously. Maybe this is enough for ramp to climb? Yes, it is. Whoa! Here we are, where my very close to where my insanity run as a side character ended. I'm being taken away now. It's my turn. I'm being dragged into some kind of chamber. The ceiling is aligned with a number of panels, uh, bristling with what appear to be uh, stalactites or, or teeth. The 
Ah, there he is. Oh, come on. She's being very protective of something. AP rounds, and that's it. The end is near. Soon you shall see our final face. But do not despair. Surely the void is preferable to your pointless. Soft, soft, struggle. You have brought our tragedy. Oh. Out, out, out. We die. We die. Beware the machines of success. She is a stranger. She is a stranger to everything we cherish. Look at me here dancing on the ceiling. I suppose. You put everything forward to defend the brain, I guess. Back on the Rick and Bach. I'm running my errands, puppet. I know you have struck. Strut struggled, but I never had any intention of destroying the Von Braun. Destroying the Von Braun. The Von Bonds, faster than light drive, can be used to create pockets of pro pro, pro pockets of proto reality. I am now using it to modify reality to, to my to my own specifications. The process shall not take long, long, long. If it sounds unpleasant to you, put your mind at ease in insect. You will not survive to see my new world order. Oh, what a surprise. Well, we're down the many. Um, Sheridan's kind of figured out how to hack reality with an FTL drive. I suppose we need to end this. Quickly.